Hello there, good folks. And uh, here we are. Uh, season opens a week from this Saturday. This is Wednesday. Yes. Yep. So it opens a week from this Saturday. So this is the last week of vlogs that we'll be bringing that won't have season in it are approaching. Well, here we are. And there's still no logging equipment and all that in here over here at Lee County. That's what we're over here in Lee County now to pick up the cards. We're a day late because we had to go over to Bethune and uh, and work on some stuff over in that area. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, we're going to bring you guys along. Let's see what's moving around over here. Hey there, folks. While we're riding the hilltop, uh, just going to tell you, it is crunch time here in Game Zone 4. This is the last week of scouting, and the season will open not this Saturday. Today is uh, Thursday, uh, the 22nd. A week from Saturday, gun season opens here in Game Zone 4 in South Carolina, and it will be kicked off right along with, with football, college football. Oh, baby, it's the most wonderful time of year coming up right now. So... Uh, like I said, it's crunch time, so we're crawling in these stands. Uh, we're moving stands to find their final locations for the seasons, getting covers put on, fixing braces, replacing chairs, all this stuff, cleaning all the spiders out of the stands and bees' nests and all that other stuff. So here we go. We're getting things. We, we wrapped up things in Lee County yesterday, and we will finish up in the River Swamp tomorrow. So here we go, guys. Get ready, get set, it's time to start popping them now. Ooh. It's and when it's crunch time, folks, like this, we we have to check check the stands and I uh, check and make sure that the uh, there ain't no wasps nest. See, and then we look at the spider webs. Yeah, up in the chairs. We check and make sure the chairs are good for another year. Hold on, I got like Miss Joanne cutting the stuff okay. that's hanging up. Okay. Here, I will. I will mess with the, um... Oh, yeah, you got the cutters, so you I'll can... i get the spider web. You can weed the spider web out. Yeah, I think you think it's about dead anyway. Yeah, that's what... They sound like they're dry. Yeah. Okay. Is it? Yeah, it's working. Okay. It looks like it's wide. From here, standing at the bottom of the stand, it's wide open. Yeah, that looks good. I don't think nothing has to be cut here. Here you go. All right. Okay, we gotta we gotta make some adjustments on the sand hill stand. That's the next stop. Close up sand hill stand. We noticed last couple of years that this thing has been here, it is too high. When you sit down, if you're not on a big old thick cushion, then uh, it, it's too high. The girls have a real hard time getting a rifle situated to, to brace it to take a shot. So me and Miss Joanne have got to try to unbolt this this uh, carriage around here and lower it down about six inches. Hopefully. Okay, we lowered the front end of the sand hill stand about four or five inches. You had to sit on a cushion up here to uh, 
to be able to shoot over them. Oh yeah. This is this is good. Now now you can actually use your shooting stick. Alright. See anything that needs to be cut? No. No, one thing it is it from here down the road it is solid all the way down. It would have to do a lot of cutting. It's just gonna have to wait till they get to the uh to the opening over there. Okay. Alright, well that's done. Miss Joanne is still cutting. She's been cutting 200 yards. I got to get up in the big plot stand here and look and see see how it looks from up here. We put in new braces last year, so we don't have to deal with that this year. All right, let's see get my big behind up in there. Rachel and Joanne put new floor in here last year, right on top of the old one, put new braces. Huh, spider webs everywhere. Huh, see that? See the kills marked off here? I don't know if that's still up to date or not. All right, let me see if I can get up in here. The steps are leaning. Looks like you got it all good, honey. It's definitely opened up now. Okay. See, now mineral station is way up there in the corner right there you'll recognize the scene from when we sit in it during hunting season all right not this weekend but weekend after is opening opening weekend of gun season all right go take care of the outlaw stand and ain't nothing to do there but swap out the car and we'll be done
see this is right in front of the outlaw stand. This is uh, 20 yards. I do this for my handgun. The uh, look at the look at that run right there where they're coming over the bank. I got the camera set right there. It's sensing motion. So if they, I get them to walk out right here and understand, maybe I can take one of my 10 millimeter or 45. I tried, I try every year. Maybe it'll work out this year. You need to go see if I need to cut him. Well, guys, you recognize this shot right here, don't you? This is the outlaw stand. See where Miss Joanne's walking? That's that's where my corn pop for my handgun spot is. You need to look on I got a hole right there. Let me know. Right there. Honey, it's wide open, darling. It's ready to go. It's ready to sit. All right. All right, guys, let's get out of this heat and go home. Okay, folks, we are as ready as we can be uh, over here at Lee County. We still got a few things to do in the river swamp, but not much now. All the hard, heavy stuff is done. Uh, so we're going to go home, take a look at the cards, and see what we got moving around over here. And I'm going to show y'all what we got moving around over here. I don't know if this is going to be our last vlog, but if it's not, it will be the next to last. Next week will be it. The season starts uh, in the next week. So, this is Wade and Miss Joanne coming to you from a very hot Midlands of South Carolina. We'll be back with another one very soon. Bye-bye. And this is a big old thank you to all the folks that help support us on the Patreon channel. And with YouTube continuing to be very unfriendly to conservative channels, any help that you folks can provide is greatly appreciated. From the whole BRO crew, this is a big old thank you.